Hey, it's Juliet. Uh, I haven't got on her in a while, and uh, so much has happened. Um, I'm going to have to do a totally separate video just to tell you um, what I've been up to. I'm doing this from Texas, which is where I live now. Um, anyway, um, my face is all red because uh, I just got off of the treadmill, and you know I've been wanting to do uh, a video for a while because... Um, I've seen a lot come up um, about depression and suicide lately and you know um, everyone else has kind of said their piece and I feel like uh, I wanted to add my voice to it. Um, first of all I want to start out by saying that you know we, we often um, hear the most from people who uh, don't understand um, what it feels like to go through that. Um, lots of people um, try to be supportive the best they can, uh, but unless you've truly experienced what it's like to be so completely empty, crying on the floor and thinking that life will never be any different than what it is right in this moment, you just couldn't possibly understand. So um, what I want to say to anyone that happens to be watching is um, the enemy is the one that wants you to think that you're all alone and uh, unfortunately the people who are on the other side of uh, a suicide attempt people who have made it through and live to see their life change in just a couple of months we don't hear from those people enough I'm one of those people uh, you know my early 20s were so hard and every time something bad would happen, you know, whatever you want to call it, my hormones or just my lack of life skills, whatever it was, I couldn't deal. Um, but the thing is, is life is so different from moment to moment. You absolutely have no idea what's waiting on the other side for you. You don't need to put a lot of pressure on yourself to find out why you're here at this exact moment or what does it all mean or what is your purpose. Like, that's a lot of pressure. And like all these motivational videos that we always see, it's like, you know, you don't have to be at the very, very top to be happy. You can find happiness and purpose and joy in every single day. You can move towards a better you every single day. And when you mess up and it gets hard and you feel like you'll never get away from the way you're feeling right in the moment, I promise you that if you go to bed and you wake up the next morning and you try again, you can. And the other thing I promise you is if you choose to take your own life, You'll never get a chance to see how beautiful the life that is meant for you, that's waiting for you, you'll never get a chance to see how beautiful it can be. And all the people that it will affect, your family, your friends, they will literally never be the same because of that. And most of the time, at least in my case, I just wanted something to happen. I just wanted to stop feeling the way that I was feeling in that moment. But that's not how it works. Life is a very long journey if you'll let it unfold for you. There are so many things waiting for you. And when you're young, it's not your job to like, change everything right away. You just have to do the best you can to learn the things that you're supposed to learn and like hit the little, you know, um, what are they called? The little life milestones that you need to hit, you know? And don't mess up on the big stuff. But most of the things that you're dealing with are gonna be completely different in a few years and even just a few months, things will be different.
the last thing I want to say to you, if you're listening to this and if you're hurting, I want you to know that it doesn't matter who you are, what you've done, what people have done to you, what people have said that you are or that you aren't. You are loved so completely and so greatly by your creator. And I know some of you like don't have a relationship with God and that's fine. You can look at him however you want to look at him, but the person that made you, that created you and has a plan for you, says that you are loved. And I want you to know that you have purpose and value. Um, okay, that's all I had to say. Um, I hope that wherever you are in this moment that you find comfort and that you do whatever you can to get comfort and that um, that you get up and you start anew tomorrow and don't forget you are loved.